Video RAM is different than regular RAM in that it is used for RAM just for displaying the video. And sometimes you don't get enough video RAM by default. So if we go into any one of your virtual machines with the virtual machine turned off and right click and go to settings, then we can adjust the amount of video RAM. So we'll click on display and we see video memory right here. So memory is also known as RAM. And that's because when you turn the virtual machine off, that space on the RAM gets freed up and you can use that for your host computer. Whereas storage is going to be used and will always be used whether the virtual machine is turned on or not. So if you see that the amount of RAM is towards the bottom, you can just slide that up towards the top. And there's really no risk at going to 128 megabytes, especially nowadays when we have eight gigabytes of RAM or higher. Just to double check, you can go down to your task manager, just right click on your task bar and choose task manager and go to performance and memory. And this is where it's pulling the memory from. So we see in this case, I've got around 16 gigabytes of RAM and I'm only using 15%. So 128 megabytes is really nothing compared to 16 gigabytes that we have on that particular computer. So that's how you increase the video memory. And you typically know you need to add more memory if you have a lot of freeze ups, crashes, or your video doesn't display properly. Go ahead and increase that all the way to the top and you should see an improvement in quality and performance.